Hello and welcome to a new video about augmented reality. This time we are going to talk about what tasks or what are, what can be covered by augmented reality, where it might have influence, eh? field of applications. This is our, this is our discussion. Eh? So, one possible thing which is for sure supported by by augmented reality is to, to support in complex tasks. Yeah? So we may have support in complex tasks. Yeah? There is some maintenance, there is some something to be repaired, yeah? there is a, a sensor or something like this needs to be replaced. Yeah? Or there is a surgeon yeah, who has to operate somehow and there is a little bit blood or there is the field that the side of view is covered and so on. There might be X revision style yeah, based on the data from a CT or MRT or something like this. For maintenance personnel, they might be located or step by step, yeah, lose this screw, okay, remove the cover, this cover and it's directly shown in the field of view what needs to be done next. Yeah? Supporting complex tasks. This is one pretty nice topic. Yeah? Where this will shift this we will see for sure. Yeah, I'm pretty sure about this. And sometimes we already see it. Yeah? With interactive supports on our mobile phones. Yeah? This is already going in this direction. Huh? We will see this. Then, of course, the industrial uh, application. What does this mean, industrial application? This means if I'm producing a machinery, some new part of, of, of a complex thing and so on, uh, I can check uh, there's a planning data and there's the real world. Uh, and if planning data and real world are fitting together, I could simply do by going there, yeah, try to project the planned machinery in the scenery. The machinery will be projected in the <laughs> scenery. Yeah, see if it fits, where it fits together. Ah, oh, really, there is, there is a tube coming out. Or, ooh, no, this one, this little corner here, this is not in the plan, so we have to adapt a little bit. Industrial applications. Yeah. The navigation. Show the direction I have to go directly in my vision. Yeah. See, now take this lane. Go left, go right. Yeah. Not only for cars or something like this, for, for traffic, but also, you know, if you're a supporter in a big uh, maintenance guy in a big complex, uh, you have to go where this one sensor is broken to replace it. Yeah? And it will lead you there. Why not? Huh? Navigation. And a field which already fully arrived is in digital cameras. Digital camera, you know, there is additional information. There's additional, there's a live view, uh, there's additional, there's additional information about topics. Uh, you know, there is, I've noticed there is a face, I've noticed this is the area the autofocus now is. There are grids displayed that we can, this is all. You know this, yeah? even from your smartphone. Yeah? There's additional information about the photo I'm going to take displayed on the display, which helped me take better photos. Yeah? Digital camera. Yeah? Then also some art. Yeah? Display art. Yeah? Display art, which is somewhere else, yeah? or which is not, which is not finished yeah because the artist died or something like this yeah? then it might be 
completed by the use of augmented reality. You see some real parts and the rest is augmented. This is how it should have looked like. Art. Oh, the big field is military. Military. You know, is this, a, is this enemy or is this a friend? Yeah? If it can be marked somewhere in my vision field, ooh, this is a bad guy. Yeah? A bad guy. These are the others. Yeah? Not sure if all others are bad guys, but you know, complex situation. Yeah? Might be nice to know. Yeah? Also, hydrology, geology. Geo geology, geology. Yeah. You know, you you're located somewhere in the field, yeah. scenery, and you put on your glasses, your AR gear, yeah. and you see, okay, there must be water, yeah, so I can make a fountain here, yeah. a well, yeah. or aha. Uh -huh, there is a vein, there is the gold vein, dig in, yeah, this is the direction we have to go. Or we want to, to drill a hole yeah, for a tunnel. And then you know, okay, this is this type of, of, of stone and this is another type of stone, so we have to be careful. We can select different. And if you see it already implemented, you, you know, it helps simply. Architecture, architecture, big field. Display plant houses where they going to be, or display historical houses where they was, where they were, of course. Huh? They were. Huh? To, to, to make it, this is how it looked like 100 years ago. Huh? This already fits to another, this, uh, Learning. Yeah. So architecture, yeah. it's clear. Yeah. You want to have new windows, how does it look like? Augmented reality. Yeah. Then of course simulation is also is also done. Can help yeah, to simulate certain stuff. Yeah. Collaboration. We have learned a lot about online meetings uh, during the pandemic. Online meetings, online meetings, we are sitting in front of screens and so on. What if we would sit in a virtual or in a conference room yeah, and I would see really the people I'm talking to sitting there, but they are augmented. Yeah? And everybody sits in his own conference room and can place the people where he wants, here he or she wants. Yeah? And they can discuss to each other. Yeah? Collaboration. And always, there is no new technology without this field of application. Advertisement. It's always part of the deal. Yeah? Advertisement is necessary. Yeah? Just a new way of shoving commercials into your mind. Yeah? I don't say it's useless. Yeah? Because sometimes, you know, this architecture and advertisement this cooperate sometimes, yeah. So there are, you can order, you can order uh, furniture yeah, and see how it looks like. Yeah? This is somehow a combination of architecture and adver advertisement. New bed, yeah. Downloads the data from the catalog, book, place it there, uh, like the other model, try, pack, pack, and so on. It's valid point. Yeah? Big thing, learning. It open ways, it opens ways 
where you, you know, you can really leave those things then. Eh? I know there are tours through Berlin where you can see where the wall was going, eh? where it was separated and so on. Yeah, Augmented, you see it in real, you see it how it looked then, you can feel a little bit the history, learning. Eh? Typical application. And also sports. There are a number of, of possible tasks. For instance, there is augmented climbing. You stand of the, in front of the climbing wall and you see, ah, there is a flower I want to have, so I climb to there. The flower is of course not really there, but it's augmented and I can, so it makes the sport a little bit to a game. Huh? Maybe you can display things, how it looks behind or, yeah have additional information in your vision, yeah? race drivers, yeah? the speed or whatever, directly in the vision, they don't have to look somewhere else. Sports. This is, these are, so these are the different type of, of, of applications and I just want to show you now something, yeah? I hope I can find it, here is it, translator. Yeah? This already works pretty well. I just grab here a very old. This is from 1994. This is a lab a protocol yeah, from my school time. Yeah. From my school time. You see, it's German. Yeah. And I want. To translate this, so I simply place. What is this? Ah, you see? It. Can you see it? Ah, it's not that easy. Yeah, performance measurement equation, measured value table. Yeah, this is the German version, and if we place it here, yeah. Yeah, so it's it's translated on the fly. Yeah? It even tries to to estimate the type of font and so on. Yeah? But with this old type of font, it maybe does not it does not succeed. Let's see if it can handle name name yeah catalog number vintage. Uh, Maybe I should move it a little bit to the top. See. Exercise number. This is a typical application. And you see, those small items, they work pretty well. However, you still realize it's artificial. Maybe. Someday in future, we just have to wear our goggles yeah, and we can read everything because it's automatically translated. We can go in China, in Thailand, in Japan, somewhere in Arabia. Doesn't really matter. Different type of fonts. For me, everything looks German. Would be nice, right? <laughs> Would be nice. So this is field of applications and I'll show you a little bit something about it. Next time you have seen it was working, yeah, but you have to live with some something, yeah, depending on the device. What are the challenges and why where the future might might take us will then be in next video. So next video we are going to talk about challenges in, in, in augmented reality. Why it is that difficult? For this time, thank you very much for listening, goodbye.